Hello everyone, today in this video I'm going to be showing you guys how to boost your FPS only using Blockstrap. So let's get right into the video. And I finally got unbanned chat. Now obviously one of the first things you guys want to do, open up your Blockstrap menu real quick. You want to go to fast flags. After you get to fast flags, anti-analysing, one, disable player shadows, turn that off so it shows no shadows behind people. Disable pause. <laughs> Post processing effects, turn that off. Disable this frame limit, just put that to 5000, or you can cap it to your monitor's refresh rate. Uh, after that, scroll down a little more, and then rendering mode, keep this on automatic. Texture quality, put this to the lowest, and then if you keep scrolling down, you can change your font size. That really doesn't do anything. Now, they kind of patched this, Roblox patched this, but uh, let me actually just show you guys what it looks like in game real quick. Alright, so we're back in the game, and one of the main changes you guys can already see is the way my clothes are looking right now. They're looking really ugly, and you can tell everything is like, have bad quality and stuff. One of the other things is if you look at the menu, actually, it has like, it's just all bad quality, basically, overall. Same if you change the graphics, it doesn't really change anything, but uh, I'm gonna show you guys how to make it look a little better, but you still get an FPS boost. So once you guys actually go to Blockstrap, you can keep this off. Disable player shadows, turn that back on, turn this up, keep this on, uh, disable turn textures, keep that on, and then if you go down to texture quality, you actually just want to put this to level 2 or level 1. I will show you guys what level 1 and level 2 looks like real quick. So here's a quick example of what level 1 looks like. It kind of looks a little better, but kind of similar at the same time. And let me, guys show, let me show you guys level 2. So here's what level 2 looks like. Now level 2 kind of looks a little better, but it might hurt your FPS a little bit. And you might like get a little spike. But uh, yeah, that's kind of what it looks like. But before we actually end the video, just go check out. Don't forget to check out my tweaks. And also the GitHub tweaks of the fast tweaks. Both links will be in the description down below. Now the GitHub one, you can make your own customizations and own customiz customized tweaks. Okay, I don't know why I can't speak. And then with mine, these are just the settings that I use when I'm playing games. Uh, here's my ping optimization. Some people have problems with it. So I really hi highly recommend you guys to play around with it. If it doesn't work, then you can just simply delete it. It's not that hard. And uh, yeah, let's get right back into Roblox real quick. Alright, so that's going to wrap up today's video, but I did forget to show you guys one extra tip. So let me actually just show you real quick. So I forgot to actually show you guys, if you go to mods and scroll all the way down, you see disable full screen optimizations. <laughs> Don't forget to turn that on actually, because as you can see, it actually does a lot with performance. But yeah, that was kind of like the last tip. Anyways, guys, if you guys enjoyed this video, comment down the word talkies if you made it this far into the video. And I'll see you guys in the next one.